is we discovered that you can't bisect a circle. There's no such thing as a 2D circle. It's, everything's really 3D. Everything has breadth, width, height. Ben, do you have any questions? What's in the middle of this again? I think there's an emanation, that spirit. It could be coming out of the center of the dome. I just haven't explained clarity. Positive, negative, positive, negative, positive, negative. But it isn't based on that. See how the positive is always a mirroring of a negative, the positive is always a mirroring of a negative, the positive is always a negative. But for every positive, you have a negative in um, two positives, you have a negative in the center. And for every negative, two negatives, you have a positive in the center. The center is the control. It looks like it's binary. Positive, negative, positive, negative, positive, negative. It looks like it's binary, one, two, four, eight, but it isn't. Because you see this right here? The binary code, now this is a real serious spin, is over a triangle. That's called triangulation. If you follow the binary code, the angular ratio, if you add every two numbers together that consecutively in sequence touch, one plus two is three, two plus four is six, four plus eight is 12 is three, eight and seven is 15 equals six, seven plus five is 12 equals three, five and one is six, it's always three, six, three, six. What is the binary code doing on a triangle, mm. a triangulated net? It shouldn't be that way. Mm. It's profound. Still with me a little? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Let me jump tracks for a second. The scripture is stunning, the Baha'i scripture. There's a book called The Hidden Words, The Seven Valleys and the Four Valleys. Some are poetic, some are mystical, some are uh, explained prophecy. They're very enriching. Uh, it's just ex um, exquisite, the language, the rapture, the abstraction. Um, so yeah, I, I, your question was, how does this relate to God and creation? How do I show perfection? How do I tie it all together? And it's a big job, a very, very big job. So um, as I talked earlier with Ben, we talked for several hours, it was exhausting. I actually watched him get tired. <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> I yawned once. Um, this is the, the, lin, lin, the, the, I think they call it the linchpin, it's the key to everything. There can never be a, be a mistake in it, there can never be wrong, there's no redundancy, and there's nothing that exists outside it. I have found, it's called the gut equation. Grand Unified Field Theory. There isn't one thing that it doesn't explain.